A pair of beautiful sandhill cranes, big, tall, stork-like birds, are back on the attack at a Melbourne intersection. The birds are defending their nesting territory and defending it from people's cars and trucks. Moving the birds' nests didn't help. West News' Jen Billow has the story. All new at 6. The sandhill crane is a very territorial bird. If you get too close, he'll let you know. All these scratch marks here, he stood uh, right here and he attacked my car. The male crane takes on a Ford Fusion here, stopped at the intersection of NASA and Evans. He seems to dislike the shiniest cars. He see. was bam, 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 and I was afraid I'd kill him. This all started a couple of weeks ago when this pair had a nest near the intersection. When cars stop for the red light, the male will go right out into traffic to chase away the intruders. So fish and wildlife officers moved the nest, but that didn't work. The birds abandoned the nest and the eggs died, but the birds continue to defend their territory. And I'm just extremely frustrated that somebody doesn't do something. If I can get them to cross over into the big pond, I was hoping maybe they would both stay. Nothing has worked. Wildlife officers check the birds every day and will discourage them from building a new nest. In the meantime, drivers are cautioned to watch for attacking cranes. I think it's a little humorous. In Melbourne, Dan Billow, West 2 News.